Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Now today we're gonna talk about water tap. Yes, excuse me a minute. We're gonna talk about this thing. I think we have all seen this. We use it every single minute or day time. It's a water tap. Now this is plastic type. They're metal type. They're all types of. First, before we go to the types, I just want to we explore how these taps work. Today we're gonna do PVC tap, plastic bathroom taps or taps in general which are plastic. They are also metallics. So, what are they made of? So, our taps are made from acetyl copper, copper polymer. BOM, a material used extensively yeah, in those countries, Europe, America, and stuff like that. And there are many types of them. So, like we have mixer, mono, monoblock, pillar, peep, wall mounted. I think you have seen all these mobile mounted tabs, deck mounted, non concussive, sequential, all types of names. So, when I look at long PVC tabs, pillar PVC, nipple, cross PVC, PP, middle rib tabs, that's for many. But the one we're gonna examine is this one. And uh, maybe I should perform an experiment first before we can come up to you with this thing. Okay. Here I have a bucket. Okay. And by the way, I think pressure also plays part in this because we have heard of low pressure and there's no water. High pressure, that's what, excuse me. So, yeah, plays part. Pressure is very important. Now, here we have a washer inside. I'm not going to disassemble this. This tap is in a very good condition. And uh, I just, you know what is there actually. And uh, if you do like this, this one operates like open like this you can close like this simple yeah there is a washer inside here I'm, I'm, I'm this person who like dismantling things so let me see what is possible to to dismantle No, actually, if I do this, it means breaking it totally. And they're very delicate, so if you do this, you want to lose it. So, let's see how it works. So, I want to pour water. Now it's closed. I'm pouring water, water, water. Okay. You see it's closed and water is full here. Now assuming a pipe is here. From the, the pipe is here and this is a tap. So once I open here, let's see open and see. You see. I don't know what they are seeing. Yeah, water is coming, but there's no pressure. Here is a washer. I've just put it upside down. So when the situation why it's like this, water has to come up. So for that reason, it will need some pressure, kind of, yeah, because now, like for example, let me see again, if I put water here, I think is it Pascal law, it deals with pressure, pressure is exerted equal in all direction, is that what he said? So I'm, I'm using my finger to close from down, so water does not drip. And I'm assuming now this is the way it is in the tap. I'll close the finger here. Now I'm gonna open this thing again and see whether it will flow. Yeah, you see it's flowing. But of course there's pressure, you know there's air there. Once I put my finger here, it means some pressure is there. Because I've closed some air molecules there. So they're under pressure and they're gonna push this water over. And some, some is there, you know, <laughs> not all of it came out. 
and now this thing serves in a continuous flow. It means the valve inside opens. I can't see much of it because I'm not gonna break it anyway. Yeah, it closes actually inside. You, there's no way you can see it from there. But if you open like this, you can see. You can see. I put it like this. If you look carefully, you'll see. So let me bring it closer. Let me clo bring it closer. Now watch, watch that hole there. See what happens. You see something is moving inside there. You can see. See, see, see how it's going, going, going. It's open. You see, it's open. And water is gonna flow. And then see, um, it's closing down, closing. See, look inside the hole. See what's going on. It's closed. See, let me repeat again. See, there it's opening slowly, 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 slowly. See. I mean it's flicking, I, I need to keep it steady. So that hole is there, that's a washer. Mm. They are closed. You are staring inside the hole, not on top, just inside, see. See again, it's open, it's open, it's open. So this is the way it operates, but in other tabs you have to turn it anti-clockwise and then water will flow so this is a very important thing in our homes because we use this every time and you know water is life without water there's no life so so how does water tap work it's called a pvc water tap polyphenyl chloride water tap PVC stands for that and then polyphenyl chloride is synthetic polymer or plastic I think this is uh, of course this is synthetic this is polymer this is plastic it's not a metal yeah made from polymers I think if you have an idea what polymerization is then you will understand what polymer is so sorry it's very hot guys so now how does water tap work? Of course, I told you that now the flow of water is controlled by turning or moving the tap. Yeah, this one is just controlled by doing this. Uh, by, by just opening up here and closing. The others where you have to rotate it and clockwise or clockwise to close and clockwise to open. You doing all that time, you know, all this thing, moving the tap handle. So let's repeat it. The flow of water is controlled by the by turning or moving the tap handle, which is connected to a spindle. The spindle is the metal to which the thing you are turning around is connected. So when moved, the spindle causes the tap valve to move. I think that thing you saw inside there is a valve. It moves upward or downward, causing the water jumper to open or close. In this case. This is one of ours. It's not moving like that. You can see it's moving sideways. But you can say upward. Upward means up, but this one moves sideways. Like if I do like this, you look inside the hole. Look inside the hole. You see? I think it's not showing. Why? Oh, sorry. I don't know why it's not showing. We just saw it a minute ago. And I was showing you this inside the hole. Inside the hole. <laughs> you know, I have to find the orientation. See, the hole is opening. This one it moves sideways. You can open it sideways, but this one, say, the other ones that you turn and clockwise or clockwise, uh, it moves up and down <laughs> along the spindle. So causing the water to flow, of course, again, we need pressure there for the water to flow. So I've done a diagram on that. For that one, which, uh, which you move turn clockwise and clockwise, you have parking nut. Is there a gland parking? I can't draw the diagram, but there is something that looks like this. I don't know what is the problem. You can't see, but bring it much closer, you can see. 
very close indeed. You can see the, even in my writing, you can see I've named the internal part of cross section of it. Mm. So, we have washer, we have water source, of course, where water is coming from the tanks, the stem through which it comes, the handle. It's just as simple as that. So, what's the take here? The take is that you have to know how to produce this. Or you, we are consumers, so we buy them in the market. Something like this I bought for 20 bucks, it means uh, in Indian rupees, 20 rupees. But I think the, the seller there <laughs> didn't do justice to me. Uh, because it's not really from the shops, not new, totally new. Or oh, maybe it's new, looks new. I guess it should be around 10 rupees. But I bought it 20 bucks, 20 rupees. Yeah, it's plastic, totally plastic. So guys, and this thing works, I think, also pressure plays a part. Because I remember when I go to the tap, like where I live, I open the tap and the tap is dry, there's no water coming. Then somebody tells me, oh, the pressure is low. So you, you need to use a motor. When you put a motor, then water comes. What does the motor do? It pumps the water. So pump means some pressure is exerted, some work is done. Right? Yeah, man. So this video is just as short as it is. I don't think there's much to talk about. Mm. Of water taps. So thanks for watching. Please stay tuned, subscribe to my channel, like, share, comment, give your ideas and opinions about these things. Bye. See you in the next one. Bye for now.